She walked into the kitchen where most mornings would begin. Put her hands down on the counter, stretch her fingers long and thin. Drug her eyes across the wall to where he hung his mandolin. Then she whispered out the count like she was whispering it to him. Morning song, morning song. You were always on my mind, even though now I am gone. I taught you these four chords so you could sing your morning song. He was not much of a singer There was shrapnel in his sound Always ready with a zinger That could burn the whole place down The love was undefinable No beginning and no end Like so many ancient secrets Ever blowing in the wind Listening to 881 KDHX St. Louis. We're going live from the stage right now, our venue here in the building. And in case you're just joining us, that's Shovels and Rope uh, making that good noise for y'all. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. There are thousands of people in here. You guys, <laughs> you guys should see it. <laughs> we appreciate you guys all showing up uh, early like this. Well, t today's Mardi Gras. It's Mardi Gras Tuesday. Is that true? Joe the Bonton Relay. Yeah, and this is a French city, and uh, I'm a Francophile, me, and uh, this is a song uh, we wrote uh, on an early Mardi Gras morning. Am I playing the right song for the people on the radio? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we, uh, we were coming down. 
from New York City, you know, and it was really starting to snow pretty hard up north. And it was raining down south, and we were on our way to New Orleans, and when we pulled in, we weren't sure if uh, Mardi Gras was going to even take place. Next morning, Mardi Gras came as it does, <laughs> and uh, we all got dressed real early in the morning and went revelry all over town. Good friends of ours, they were getting married, you see, on Mardi Gras Day, and they had a great costume theme. They were the owl and the pussycat from the little golden books, you know, that you read to your kids. So we were carousing, and we made our way down to the Mississippi River with the St. Anne's Parade and watched our friends get married there. And it was one of the most beautiful days as the clouds broke and the sun shone down on the river that we were watching a couple start their lives together, and we were really moved. And so this song came out of it.
I can't remember ever feeling so alive And I need more fingers to count the ones I love This life may be too good to survive This life may be too good to survive So we wrote this song with my uh, m uh, my stepdad, Michael, his father-in-law, and I. Um, it's a <clears throat> it's a, a factual song about a, a civil war battle that happened in our front yard of the house they live in in Chattanooga. It's called Missionary Ridge. <laughs> Action in the Army of the Cumberland, the 15th Army Corps. Just a few years back, it was a bunch of boys, never left home before. And the shame the chick and Marga, so hungry they could almost die. Without any order from the general, the clamor of the mountainside, the clamor of the mountainside. Whistling Dixie on Missionary Ridge Don't call to warm those poltergeists Open up the casket lid You wake those boys to wonder Among the old carnage So oh, don't go whistling Dixie on Missionary Ridge I'm numbered by the blue coats two to one, took to its tail to flee. The Union broke the Confederate line, marched south to the sea, marched south to the sea. Don't go whistling Dixie on Missionary Ridge, don't go to warm those bolter guys, open up the casket lead. Missionary Ridge Ooh. 